G'day, Clint Patterson here with another tip on reversing rheumatoid arthritis symptoms naturally. Today I want to talk about the best exercise that I do each morning to help with my bad knee. Uh, this exercise is also one that I gave my mum a couple of years ago and she's had two arthroscopies, uh, one on each side, and uh, it's helped her tremendously. So her quality of life has improved a lot. Um, it's also a very functional movement that has been recommended to many people by Carl Reader, who's a functional movement coach who I just had on my podcast. So let's check out this exercise and you can decide if you want to implement it each morning uh, or, uh, or later in the day, if your knees are a bit slow to warm up in the morning. Uh, obviously, uh, you need to take into account your own physical uh, condition, but this is what I do and so you can uh, implement it only if you wish, but let's have a look at it. So what it is, is we're going to use a chair and I've set that up over there like that with a bolster on it. Now the reason I've put a bolster on the chair is because we want to um, reduce the amount of load on the knee. So obviously protecting the knee and wanting to do further damage to the knee, uh, avoid further damage to the knee is our highest priority. We want no downside, all upside. Okay, so we want to feel the knee getting better every day uh, and we do not want to sort of find that something we're doing is irritating it. Okay, now what we're trying to do is we're trying to build the connective tissue around the top of the knee, uh, above the kneecap, and also build the strength in the quads, a little bit in the hamstrings and the glute muscles, because a nice set of quality muscles around the knee takes a lot of the shock absorption and therefore causes less pain in the knee and helps prevent further damage if you've got uh, osteoarthritis or you still have uh, inflammatory arthritic condition in there, like rheumatoid activity. Okay, so let's get into it and boom, boom, boom. So, come over uh, and you can see that my knees are more than 90 degrees. Okay, so I'm, if I took the bolster off, my legs would be at 90 degrees, but when you've got damage, that's just too much load through here. So let's make it easier for ourselves, especially if we're getting started. Uh, this, this exercise should feel fairly easy. We shouldn't be trying to um, challenge ourselves too much at the start. If this is even too much for you, then load it up even further and come up so that you're even higher. Okay, there's no harm in that. We want to be able to get started, that's the thing, um, as opposed to doing nothing because you'll get muscle atrophy, atrophy and the knees will have to take more and more of the load and they will hurt more and more. Okay, so what we want to do is create our feet parallel to the um, to each other, like train tracks, two parallel train tracks, and about um, hip width apart uh, is what I like to do, and get your arms out in front of you as a counterbalance. Then we, with weight in the heels and our uh, pelvis uh, tucked back, we're gonna stand up, okay? Then down, stand up, down, stand up, down, stand up. And what you'll notice is that my bum is really sticking out on the way back. And I am emphasizing weight in the heels all the time, okay? So the weight in the heels is crucial, so is the buttocks sticking out all the way. Now, if you wanna challenge yourself, come down slower, makes it more difficult, okay? Like that, all right. So, so that simple exercise done every morning, um, like you might wanna choose at first just two sets of 10, okay, just to get started if you're in a compromised physical state. Or maybe, um, you know, you could do more than that, but just, I, I, I suggest if you wanna give it a try, then just test it, right? So that's just one of the exercises that you can do uh, for your knees. Uh, to help and I found it very useful and it's a rehabilitation exercise that's commonly recommended as I said by um, professionals uh, that I trust. So anyway that's part of a complete sort of guide of knee healing um, routines that I have inside our Patterson program. So if you're interested in a program that helps not just the knees but all other joints and also all the dietary side of things to help reverse inflammation, then check out Patterson program. In the meantime, uh, as I catch my breath here, uh, it wasn't that hard, but I was talking while I was doing it. Um, in the meantime, uh, please post a comment below if you have any comments or if you have any questions, uh, any other videos you'd like me to make, uh, give me a thumbs up, 
hit subscribe. Thanks so much. I'll see you on the next video.